From past few months, I'm getting a lot of queries from students, from professionals who are from non-IT background, such as commerce, business, mechanical, electrical, chemical, or other graduation fields. So they want to study masters in data science. They want to study master in artificial intelligence in Germany. But the problem is they are not from software background. They are not from computers background. So they are not eligible for most of the courses they want to study at. I totally understand your concern. I spoke with some of them and I gave them the idea what they can do. And I thought as many of you are facing the same challenges, I'm getting the queries on my YouTube channel. I'm also getting the emails. So I thought why not shoot a video on the topic? That is why in today's video, I'm going to talk about if you are from non IT or non computers background, how you can be eligible to study master in data science or how you can be eligible to study master in artificial intelligence in Germany by following some steps and you can apply to universities accordingly so that you can move to Germany, you can move to Europe to study here even if we are coming from non-IT background. Hi guys, this is Sandeep Khera and you're watching Conical Education. Before we proceed further, let me remind you to subscribe below and enable the bell notifications to not miss any updates on this channel. You can also follow me on my social media pages. Links for all of them are given in the description below. Let's dive into today's video. Before we proceed further, let me state the problem again in a little bit more detail so that you all of you are able to relate better what I am talking here. So as I already mentioned, you are from non IT background, you are from economics, you are from commerce, you are from mechanical, you are from electrical engineering. And now you want to study data science and now you want to study artificial intelligence in Germany. And the university requirement says you must be having bachelors related to software background, which you don't have. And you didn't study related subjects in your bachelor. So you are not eligible. So this solution is for those who are facing the same challenge. And the second, second group of people, let's say who are from electronics background or electrical background. So they might have studied some of the computer related subjects in their engineering, in their bachelors but still they do not meet the ECTS requirements from the universities what they are asking for. Though you have some knowledge about software, you have studied those subjects, even some of you might be even employed in that area in the organization, but due to your lack of degree or due to lack of ECTS, you are not able to meet the requirements of the university to get an admission into masters in data science or artificial intelligence. I know it is the biggest setback in your study plan, and you are not able to get the admission into masters in data science or artificial intelligence in Germany or Europe. That's why I'm going to share the solution right away, which you can follow and you can get the admission at a German or other European university. I will be sharing two solutions with you. Let us talk about the first solution. It is majorly relevant for the students, for the professionals who are from non technical background whether you are from economics, you are from commerce, you have studied business in your bachelor. So this solution is more relevant for you. Though others can also follow the same solution, but majorly these are the non-technical students who can benefit from this solution. Let me tell you data science and artificial intelligence nowadays are not limited to tech fields only. There are many industries such as sales, marketing, business, medical and many more which are using data science and artificial intelligence to develop new products to develop new services to reach out the more customers so this is a good news for you next step what you have to do you just visit the website dart.de or you visit the website myguide.de on that website look for the courses in data science but only related to your own field let's say you have studied the bachelor of economics you have studied Bachelor of Commerce. You have studied Bachelor of Media. So look for the courses on these websites which are related to data science but related to your field. So I will be explaining it in a little bit more detail. So for example, one course you can look for is Masters in Economics with the focus on data science and artificial intelligence. Such courses are definitely available. You just have to look very carefully. You have to scroll down through the all the list of data science and AI courses and you will definitely find them. And the next step for you is that once you find such courses, go into the requirements section of those courses. 
and you will see that they are looking for the students who are from economics background who are from commerce background who are from other non tech background so if you meet those requirements you have that bachelor degree then during the masters you will study the data science concepts you will study the ai concepts in context of your bachelor degree itself so in that way you will be eligible to study data science in germany study ai in germany and the motive of those courses is that once you finish your degree once you finish your masters you get into the field you start working and you apply those data science concepts in your field of study in the field of economics in the field of commerce in the field of other non tech areas and that is why these courses are specially designed for such kind of non tech students only requirement is that you must be having a recognized degree as per the anabin database in the field of economics in the field of commerce or other non tech field and then you must meet the ects requirements of the university then you can easily apply to that course and study masters in data science in germany here on the screen you can see one such example university where they are teaching masters in economics with data science and policy they have clearly written down that in bachelors you must have studied the business or economics and having 60 ects during the degree so if you meet this requirement you can apply to data science course this is the snapshot of the university of halen wittenberg you can go and check out the website of the university and you can look for this course and you will find that okay this is really possible so during that study you will learn about the concepts of data science concepts of ai apply them into practice during your study make your projects and finally you get into the field of data science related to your own field itself so it is a way to enter into data science field if you want to come to germany do you want to study data science and you want to work in the field of data science in the long run in europe let us talk about the second solution now this solution is more relevant for the people for the professionals who are already working in data related fields such as data analyst data scientist or artificial intelligence so you have the work experience so you have the knowledge about data science but the problem is either you are from uh, non it background but you are from tech background itself for example you are a mechanical engineer or you are a electronics engineer or in some cases you might be even from the non tech background but uh, but you are still working into data analyst field and due to this reason you don't meet the ects requirements of the university and you are not eligible to apply for msc in data science or ai and study in germany let me tell you if you carry the technical knowledge about the data science field about data analysis or ai and you are from non tech background or you are from non it background then you can prove your knowledge you can prove your knowledge to the university by taking the written test or by clearing their interview round and prove them yes you are capable you have worked in this area and you carry the required knowledge to study masters in data science or ai then you can take admission into that university this is really possible universities are open for you if you meet their admission requirements by taking the test or by clearing the interview look at the example on screen here i have the example of ludwigshafen university of economics and society in the snapshot you can see very clearly that they have mentioned in the requirements that if you are not from it or computers background not from software background you just clear their written test if you gain at least 50% of the marks in their test then you will be eligible to apply for master study in data science and ai in this university so which is really a good news for you if you are already working into data science or ai and you don't have a related degree let me tell you another example of this same university if you go on this course which i just shared on the screen and the, if you look at the current snapshot which is now displaying on the screen it is clearly written down let's say you are from the software background but you don't carry the economics knowledge you don't carry the commerce knowledge but then after taking their written test after passing that exam you score 50% in their written test in economics in commerce or other non tech field you will be eligible to study data science in business related areas at this university so this is really really good and it is giving you the opportunity to study data science in germany even if you are not from the related background when it comes to your bachelor study so i just want to convey it is all possible to get admission into ai into data science into master study if you are from non related background 
you just have to put in the effort to find the right universities by visiting the website myguide.de or dart.de you just have to put in the effort to find the universities who are accepting students from the non related background you just have to prove during the application process why do you think you are eligible for the course and eventually you have to clear their written test or you have to clear their interview round and once you clear that written test or interview round you will definitely get the admission at this university in spite you are from non related bachelor background this is all i have in today's video give a thumbs up or comment below share with your friends and subscribe to the channel have a good day